वेलकम टू वेब स्टार ब्रस वट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन एज एंड फॉर एज मैथड्स दिस कैन बी ए सॉलिड फ्रंट एंड इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन एंड इट्स ए ट्रिक क्वेश्चन आई हैव गॉट एन इंडेक्स डॉट एच टी एम एल पेज एंड स्क्रिप्ट डॉट जी एस इज लिंक टू विद इट देन वी हैव गॉट जी क्यू अटैच विद इट ओके लेट्स इफ वी हैव दिस अरे कॉन्स्ट बॉक्स One, two, three, four. Four elements inside it, and we want to apply each method and for each method. Add this box. How can we do that? By definition, each method is iterating over an object, executing a function for each matched element. and for each method executes a provided function once for each array element for each method box dot each index and element fat arrow console log element multiplied by 2 these are arguments and this each method will be closed let's see the output 2468 2468 so this is fine and if we use for each method then box dot for each element index array console log we need element from it let's comment it save refresh and same answer so what is the difference between for each and each is it clear now okay so they are pretty similar it's iteration and execution of a function for each element but one obvious difference is each method is used in jquery and for each method is used in vanilla javascript this is the obvious difference so if someone asks what is the difference between each method and for each method you can say that obvious difference is each method is used in jquery and for each method is used in vanilla javascript for each is implemented native in the browser which makes it easier to maintain for non jquery developers but if you want to dig into details each uses a short circuit method to do similar thing in javascript use every method or some method every or some methods unlike for each method let you break or stop the iteration as well this is each method in jquery and this is for each in javascript Okay I hope it helped like share subscribe and I will see you in the next video